Mohammed Ali Rashid Luta, President and CEO of Dubai Chambers, a big congratulations on the launch of the Dubai Center for Family Businesses. Could you start by uh, telling us what are the key initiatives and key parts of family businesses you'll be supporting within the center? Today, we announced the first milestone of uh, launching the Family Business Center of Dubai. Uh, there are several initiatives that we announced today. The first one is uh, the governance series. It's a series of events that will enable companies, family businesses, to um, know more about very important topics from a subject matter expert or from other family businesses who've done it right, either locally or internationally. Uh, covering topics such as governance and uh, the uh, protecting the wealth of family businesses and the importance of succession planning and the uh, best way to avoid uh, disputes and how to manage disputes. The second initiative was is to work closely with Mohammed Bar Rashid leadership program to announce a, a leadership program in the family businesses to make sure that we are preparing the first tier of uh, family business leaders who will take over the companies in the future. We'll do that in coordination with international universities. The third one is uh, to do uh, training programs to qualify the young leadership in the, in the companies. Uh, you know, uh, our young brothers and uh, relatives who would like to be actively involved in companies and make them aware about governance, succession planning, financing, communication and uh, how to take uh, decisions more effectively. And the fourth one is how to increase the awareness among the non-active shareholder, especially women. So we have a very important player who are the non-active shareholder. How can we ensure that they understand the systems of governance, how we can ensure that they understand the financials and how can they uh, be uh, more effective in decision uh, taking? Uh, and the, the fifth one is to have a program to qualify family business advisors. Uh, we really need to build a database of family advisors in the city who understand the local aspects of our family and to be able to help companies to apply systems such as governance, succession planning, or just help them with any of their inquiries. We will work with international institutions to qualify such advisors. And the last point is to work on studies and publication. Such studies to help companies look at the best practices, in addition to helping them to find solutions for the challenges that they face. Moreover, we will even uh, introduce uh, uh, more Arabic content by, by identifying very uh, interesting and comprehensive English content or international content in the sphere of family businesses and translate it and to make it available not only to Dubai, to the Arab world. And the center, will it be also an advisory role to the center where when a company gets large enough or that is already large, that you'll lead them to the public sector, to, to become a public yeah. company rather? We have a program that we launched in Dubai Chamber, not through the Dubai Center of Family Businesses. It's a program that we work closely with Dubai Financial Market to help companies to understand uh, the importance of getting listed. You know, getting listed is a voluntary decision from companies. Some companies prefer to remain private. Uh, through the other program that we did with DFM, we uh, increased the awareness of the importance of listing and we helped to introduce the companies to the right uh, advisors, financial advisors, who then will continue the journey privately with the company and guide them step by step on how to be prepared uh, to be listed. And initially, what kind of interest are you expecting from your members? Today, we had a very good crowd and uh, majority of the crowd are the owners of family businesses. Uh, we really need to make sure that our programs are capturing their interest since our programs are voluntary, non-mandatory. So that's why we will work closely with them to ensure that the programs we do are catering to their needs. So uh, therefore, Dubai Chamber initiated a family business uh, advisory committee. Any program or service that will be initiated by the center will be first vetted and reviewed by the family businesses advisory committee committee that we have in Dubai Chamber that consists of only family businesses owners. And then we uh, communicate 
the plans with the family business owners, take their feedback and ensure whatever services we do cater to their needs. Thank you very much indeed for joining us.